Today I'm going to be showing you how to play, um, how to make slime. And so here I've got an example of the slime I'm going to make. So this is basically some blue tack slime. I've made a little bit because I don't want to spoil the packet too much. And I want to have a lot to make. So here we've got some blue tack and it's only one ingredient. Oh, two ingredients, sorry. Um, we need blue tack soap and a cup of water here great so so how to make it well um first with the blue tack you need to stretch it and activate it or it will just be really really hard and we don't need hard blue tack we need it to be a bit softer um so now let's get started yes yeah, so here's as much blue tack need to stretch it to activate it's quite a lot so it's a bit hard to stretch okay and then you need to roll it up a bit and then stretch it again uh, yep I've got it so you need to stretch about this much and pour some soap uh, any type of soap will work uh, that's great now you need to stretch like we did yep now it's getting a bit softer now as you see your hand will become a bit wet but after you play with it for a long time it will be so much better um, the blue tack or slime and um, it will turn into it will just suck it your um, the yuckiness from your hand so as I as you saw I put more blue tack um, soap and I'm just gonna stretch So like that and you see it's getting a bit softer now you need to mold it into some shapes so molding it molding it and then stretch it again so then next step is to get some water so a jug of water and if you have a cup um a tap that's perfectly fine you could just rinse it under the tap but I don't have a tap in my room, like who would ever have a tap in their room? Uh, so I'm going to use a jug of water, but this is quite hard, so let me add a bit more soap to it. So the soap is, is basically what makes it more stretchier and more softer. Oh cool, it's way more softer now. And it's a lot of slime. Let me just get all the soap off my hands. Great. Wow. So now I'm going to just add a bit of water. Like that much. It's perfect. And as you see, I'm going to do this in steps. So I'm going to add more water after I've stretched it a bit. So that's that's not going to be too bad because if you just put a tons of water on it then you don't know how it's going to turn out and it might not be so good and also if you want you can put some dye or paint on it and it, when you put that it gets a bit more stickier so it sticks to your hands a bit more um dye is not that good i'd rather use paint but i'm not going to use anything because i think it'll be it'll be i'm just going to stick to the normal color blue because blue is a really nice color and it's also pretty so let me add a bit more water to it Wow, it's super stretchy. I haven't seen any blue tack that's that stretchy. Um, yeah, and it's almost turning into slime. That's just this is absolutely DIY, so you can make it on your own. Uh, you need to mold it, and then if it's still too hard, add some more soap in it. That's probably enough. Let's see how it turns after the soap. It's probably going to turn into slime after or after this. <laughs> you see it's getting very squeaky when you do that. <laughs> yeah. 
So in one of my videos, I made a slime video. It was about uh, making slime from a slime machine to like a slime factory machine. You need to check that out. It's super funny. Yeah, it was super funny. Um, I couldn't stop laughing. Um, and yep, yeah, it's getting a bit more stretchy. Yeah, see that? Let me add some more water to it. Just a drop there. Perfect. I, I think it's turned into slime now. So, um, I've seen other children in my class. They've been doing it. But it doesn't turn out so stretchy because they've uh, been adding dye, food colour or paint. And then it just breaks. It's not so stretchy. But if you don't, if you just keep it and keep it to its normal size, it'll be super stretchy. See that? Really stretchy. Wee. Well, I don't think we can do the poop test on this one. It's a bit too um, slidey. Alright, so... We need to make this line be as soft as this line. And I think this is okay. And I think this is okay as well. So, I hope, thank you guys for watching and I hope you enjoyed my video. And I hope you enjoy making this super, really nice, soft slime with only two ingredients and as i said it's absolutely diy so thank you guys for watching bye bye